Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Waalaikumsalam warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Let's start our class with Ummu Kitab Al-Fatihah. Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Alhamdulillahirrahmanirrahim. Ar-Rahmanirrahim. Maliki Yawmiddin. Iyaka na'budu wa iyaka nasta'in. Ihinya sirata al-mustakim. Sirata al-lazina an'amta alayhim. Khairil maghdubi alayhim. Walakalim. Amin. Let's continue with istighfar, salawat and dua. Astaghfirullah al-Azim al-Lazi la ilaha illa huwa al-Hayy al-Qayyum wa atubu ilayhi Astaghfirullah al-Azim al-Lazi la ilaha illa huwa al-Hayy al-Qayyum wa atubu ilayhi Astaghfirullah al-Azim al-Lazi la ilaha illa huwa al-Hayy al-Qayyum wa atubu ilayhi Allahumma salli ala Sayyidina Muhammad wa ala ala Sayyidina Muhammad Allahumma salli ala Sayyidina Muhammad wa ala ala Sayyidina Muhammad Allahumma salli ala Sayyidina Muhammad wa ala ala Sayyidina Muhammad Bismillahirrahmanirrahim Ya Allah, Ya Alim, Ya Hakim, Ya Rashid Sesungguhnya kau maha berilmu, maha bijaksana serta maha cerdas Kurniakanlah bagi kami ilmu serta kebijaksanaanmu Agar kami mampu menjadi khalifahmu di dunia ini Amin Ya Rabbil Alamin Okay class Now let's continue with hadis for this week What is hadis for this week everyone? Hmm. What is hadis for this week? Siapa tahu? Hadis for this week New hadis Anyone? Siapa tahu hadis for this week? No one is no. Okay, hadis for this week is about calling to write guidance and forbidding everyone. Okay, so what is mean by calling for right guidance? Siapa tahu? Hmm, Afi Ryan, apa maksudnya? Hmm, apa maksudnya Firayen? Maksudnya Tak tahu Ada siapa-siapa yang tahu? Maksudnya macam mana? Maksudnya kita digalakkan untuk melakukan ah Melakukan perkara-perkara yang Baik uh, dan meninggalkan larangannya okay, Meninggalkan larangan perkara-perkara yang tidak baik lah Itu maksudnya hadis untuk hari ini okay, Baik Can, uh, Siapa nak tolong bacakan untuk teacher ni? Want to read? Okay Mio can? Mio can you read? Allah messages Baca ayat dia Ah uh, yes, baca ini je. Okay, see. If anyone calls other to follow the guidance, his reward will be equivalent to those who follow him in righteousness. Yes. So without the reward, they diminish in interest or in the account. Yes, and, and, and if anyone invites other to follow elder, the sin of which he is guilty mm -hmm. will be equivalent to this of the people who follow him in sinfulness. Did your sins uh, been mean Nish in any respect in the ikan. Okay. Ha, so thank you Mio. Jadi faham tak apa yang Mio baca tadi? What this hadis emphasize that? This, have, this hadis emphasize that we must be ha, apa? Kita kena follow right guidance. Maksudnya kita kena sentiasa berkelakuan yang baik. Maksud berlandaskan syariat Allah lah. Allah Pesan apa? Melakukan kebaikan 
If sesiapa yang melakukan kebaikan dan mengajak orang lain melakukan kebaikan Maka Allah akan membalas dia dengan kebaikan Ah, Contohlah kan Pernah dengar tak orang kata Kalau kamu selalu bersedekah Nanti Allah akan bagi kamu rezeki yang melimpah ruah Pernah dengar tak? Pernah dengar? Macam tu? Ah, So sama lah juga macam ni kalau kita memberi, memberikan kebaikan, mengajak orang melakukan kebaikan, Allah akan memberikan reward. Allah akan memberikan balasan yang baik kepada kita. Dan sekiranya kita melakukan ataupun kita mengajak orang lain melakukan keburukan, ha, ajak member. Macam hari tu kan, ajak apa? Ajak member buat apa? Hardis for last week. Kalau kita mengajak kawan-kawan apa? Mempengaruhi kawan-kawan. Influence friends to do bad Thing. So kita juga akan ha, mendapat balasan yang tidak baiklah oleh Allah Mungkin bukan sekarang tapi suatu masa nanti Ataupun akan tercatatnya dosa dalam ha, kita punya kitab kiri dan kanan Malakat catat kan ha, So itulah dia hadis Ini cuba sampaikan untuk kita supaya kita sentiasa me- Mengajak orang lain melakukan Kebaikan. Ha, bukannya mengajak kawan-kawan kita melakukan keburukan. Boleh kawan-kawan? Boleh. Boleh. Ha, apa contoh contoh kebaikan yang kamu nak ajak kawan-kawan kamu? Can you give me an example? Hmm, apa apa contoh kebaikan yang kamu teringin sangat nak ajak kawan-kawan kamu buat sama-sama? Tolak sama-sama. Alhamdulillah lain-lain. Hmm. Solat berjemaah kan? Pahala solat berjemaah besar betul tak kawan-kawan? Betul. Okey lagi nak ajak kawan-kawan buat apa? Bersedekah ada? Kawan-kawan nak ajak bersedekah? Haa ah, Api Raya nak ajak main game ramai. <laughs> <laughs> Itu kalau game main game sambil baca hadis ya dapat pahala. <laughs> Boleh Api Raya? Okey so that is hadis for this week. Okay next. Let's move let's move to ICT word. What is ICT word for this week class? Kita kesel password. Password lagi? Kesel dengan kesel. Safety. Kesel. Uh, kesel and? Safety. Okay so today kita nak discuss about password. What's mean by password? Siapa tahu? Oh, password. Password saya ringan sebelum dapat ni. Rasanya kan? Dengar. Password kau apa? Password kau apa? Ah, yang tu kan? What is your password? Nak tahu password orang lain kan? Okay, so password ni maksudnya apa? Can you give me the definition of password? Senang ni je. Ah, what? Password saya ah. 599 dan... Oh, password, password is privacy. Jangan bagi tahu orang. Oh, Amira kata password is kunci. Okay. Kunci untuk kita buka sesuatu sistem ataupun daripada segi definisinya a okay, password is a secret word ataupun phrase ataupun character it okay, must be used to uh, to gain admission to a place ataupun allow access to a system okey ah ya tu nak dekat okey baik dia nak tahu juga Ah, jadi sebenarnya password ni privacy ke tidak sebenarnya? Ah, privacy. 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 Oleh itu kamu janganlah share dengan kawan-kawan password kamu. <laughs> okay, kalau <laughs> your friend ask you your password, so you jangan share bagi tahu password sebenar you kat kawan-kawan. Okay, so password ni. <laughs> Ha, sebenarnya password ni ada cara lah. Macam mana nak create password? How to make password strong? Siapa tahu nak pastikan password kamu adalah password yang strong? Bukannya password 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 macam tu je. Ha. Boleh eh? Yes, kita dengan ruf kecil. Yes, good. Kita kena create strong password to prevent from hackers lah. Macam kita belajar hari, uh, last week kan, word hackers. Hackers tak, dia boleh try je. Ha, biasanya user atau kita lah, kita sebagai user ni Nak senang, create je 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 Easy, simple kan So hacker ni dia pandai dia Oh Allah ha, So benda tu <tuk> sangat bahaya So sebagai contoh tadi Mio bagi tahu ya yes, Hakim nak cakap apa Mio bagi tahu tadi Nak buat password kalau boleh guna karakter si, uh, Karakter yang berbeza Contohnya huruf kecil, huruf besar Kemudian letak alias ke Lepas tu uh, number and 
Number N, huruf ke lah. Sekati kamu lah. Ha, janji jangan bagi tu orang. Okay. Yes, Akhir okay, cakap apa? Angkat tangan. Ibu bapa je. Ibu, nama ibu bapa boleh. Tapi kalau boleh, janganlah hubung nama penuh kan. Panjang sangat nanti. Afirahim bagi tahu nama bagi pasuk kat teacher. Hack teacher. Ha, dia nak teacher hack ke tu? <laughs> Percayakan teacher eh. Pasuk. Alright. So that's it. Uh, meaning by password. Okay. Teacher percaya semua orang dekat sini ada password kan? Uh, nak buka password account. phone teacher ada. Yes. Tapi uh, you guys tahu tak dekat laptop kita boleh save password kita. Uh, tapi ini kalau guna laptop sendiri je lah. Okay, tapi dia macam bahaya sikit. Yang mana contoh ha. kan? Uh, teacher tunjuk eh. Tunjuk. Okay contohnya kan untuk uh, ritual Mustafa ni teacher dah save uh, remember me. Remember me ni uh, bila teacher buka je teacher boleh nampak terus ni email berserta dengan password. Nanti teacher tak payahlah ingat dah. Teacher just log in saja. Okay. Uh, ni adalah satu cara macam mana kita nak pastikan kita tak lupa password lah. Just click dengan yeah. password. Dia tak apa password teacher. Uh, ini dia apa password? Ah, password ni 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 kan? Ini tak apa. Ah. <laughs> Okey. Apa tu? Sudah password saya. Ah, memang semua orang ah, password. Tahu, password. Ah. Yeah, sebab dia untuk kegunaan ah. semua orang. Teacher pun 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 juga. Untuk Ay, yang ni lah. Okey. So that's it. Our ICT word. Password. Okay. One. B, A, B, C, D, F, G, F, I, N. Okay, let's take your attendance. Today is 6 September. Oh, September. 10 demo untuk Hari Malaysia kan? Mesti kamu excited. Okay, Is Abu Bakar is here. Adam Naufal. Adam Naufal. Adam Naufal is here not? Oh. Ahmad Adam. Hmm. Adam Akil uh, Akram Amira Sofia Arisa Hai hey, kenapa? Asma Iza Danish Murshid Is he or not? Danish Murshid? Yes Danish Murshid? No Afirayan Haikal Irfan Hashim Yes teacher Okay, Mio, Mama Akil, Dawish, Ryan, Mama Akil. What's no bound, the land down, and the deep, they don't know. They Mama don't Ryan. Takif, Takif not yet. Sarah, Alia Maisara. Alia Maisara. Alia Maisara. Kaisa. Alicia Raiz, okay. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. Okay. 14 of you. Okay. So today we want to do some revision lah since we have done all topic. Okay. Kita dah habis belajar tau semua kelas. Jadi kita akan buat revision. Uh, tapi kita akan focus on problem solving. Ah, uh, Starting from chapter 1. Okay, chapter 1 kita akan tekankan bahagian problem solving. Yes, Akhil ada tanya apa? Akhil want to ask? Me yeah, sama Akhil. Okay. Okay, kenapa? Hmm. Oh, sorry, sorry, sorry. Akhil dah keram, yes. Kenapa Akhil? Hmm. Yes, Mama Akhil kenapa? Akhil tanya apa? Tak. Nanti dengar tak? Yes, dengar, dengar. Kenapa? Uh, ni, uh, ni, kalau Ami mengadakan program. Hmm, tak dengar. Apa? Dekat ambil minggu depan page uh, book. Hari Malaysia nanti mengadakan nanti kan? Hari Malaysia nanti. Ada cuti ke ada program? Oh, cuti tak pasti. Tapi uh, yang nombor saya tu cuti. Program tu mungkin akan diawalkan lah. Nanti kita tahu. Okay. So class, uh, so kita akan do some exercise using uh, using whiteboard P. Okay, teacher one join me. Okay, 
you want to do some exercise? Everyone, can you get my link? Boleh ke dapat my link ke sini? Dapat ke? Mereka dapat tak? Dapat, teacher. Dapat. Okay, hari ni kita akan uh, buat exercise dulu. Oh, Naura. Okay. Maybe next time, teacher boleh createkan uh, kamu punya permintaan tu. Okay, Naura. So, today kita akan buat exercise through whiteboard piece saja. Okay, next time mungkin teacher akan create using another apps lah. Okay, good. Boleh semua masuk, join teacher punya tu. Boleh? Ha, sebab teacher nak tengok kamu punya jalan kerja. Sebab tu teacher suka guna whiteboard fee ni. Okay. Next time mungkin kita boleh selitkan guna apps lain. Alright. All of you please join me faster. Kita akan jawab soalan problem solving. Kita nak tengok macam mana kamu punya kefahaman untuk jawab soalan ni. Problem solving ni is important you to know because ia akan memegang banyak markah lah kat sini. Mungkin 3 or 4 marks okay, for this question. Okay, for this uh, question teacher nak bagi ni dia mungkin akan termasuk operation plus minus uh, multiplication and divide. So you fikirlah mana satu yang sesuai untuk digunakan untuk soalan teacher nak bagi ni. Okay, I give you first question. Hmm. Kau dah join ke? Baru, enam, baru 8 orang ni. Okay, faster everyone. Siapa ni yang titik-titik ni? Titik, 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 titik. Tulis nama kamu lah. Titik tak tahu. Write your name. Okay. Pastor Bilwan, Hafi Ryan, where are you? Irfan Hashim. Hafi Ryan, uh, Hafi Ryan dah join. Yang lain mana Pastor? Akil, Arisa, Iza, Muhammad Akil, Rais, Pastor. Takif. Asma, dah join, okay. Pastor everyone. Loading, okay. Bila saya dah join, saya akan push soalan dulu. Okay class, before you answer the question, can one, one of you read this question for me? Afirayan, can you read this question? Hmm? The diagram yeah. show. Uh, read. The diagram show a number of orange in a box. The seller buy. The buy seller buy. Box. Three box of orange. He sells on 10,000 orange complete the number of orange is left. Okay. So class, as you can see on the box, kita ada tulis situ dalam satu box, we, dalam satu box, one box we have 85 orange. So, a seller buy 130 box and then he sell one at uh, he sell 10000 10000 orange calculate the number orange that is left so baki yang tinggal so how to calculate this equation i give you 10 minutes to answer this question okay 
Asma, have you get? Dan. Okay, I give you the link. Asma nak link eh. Kenapa jatuh conteng tu? Siapa jatuh conteng tu? Asma nak jatuh conteng ni. Oh, Asma terjoin. Okay, lagi. Akil, did you get my question? Not yet? Okay. Hafi tulis lah. Kais. Okay. For those yang still not get my answer, please tell me. Kita will push you the question. Hafi. Hafi, write the answer. Not apa ni? Kamu tulis apa ni? Okay. This, this erase first. Yes, Amira. Amira, where are you, Amira? Why? Oh, Amira nak soal eh. Please try to answer. Don't play. Raiz, please check. The seller buy 130 box of orange. One box. One box have 85 orange. Okay, this question involve two operation. Plus, this question involve two operation. Okay. Yes, siapa nak tanya? Kotak ada berapa Ha dekat satu kotak tu ada berapa tu Ada 85 One box have 85 orange The seller buy 130 box Okay So They have two operation In this question Before you calculate The balance of orange You kena dapatkan dulu nilai sebenar The actual value of orange That the seller buy Naura, you want me to push again the question? Naura? Yeah, okay. Have you get it? Ah, Ahmad Adam, for those yang baru join to please click the link. I give you the link and then try to answer this question. Okay. Dawish Koyim. Boleh ke Dawish Koyim? Okay everyone please try. Teacher nak tengok kamu. Faham ke tidak okay? Ingat eh, setiap tugasan yang teacher beri ni ah kamu jangan ingat teacher bagi sebarang sebarang macam tu je eh. Haa, teacher akan take note siapa yang buat, siapa yang tak buat. Mungkin soalan-soalan teacher ni membantu untuk bagi kamu markah dalam ujian kamu nanti, penilaian kamu. Haa, so kalau kamu tak buat macam teacher nak bagi markah. Okay, please try. Another five minutes. Ivan Hashim, where are you, Ivan? Ivan, are you there? Arisa, Arisa, you cannot join. Takif, where are you Takif?
tak muat Class Are you understand this question or not? Tahu Ha? Huh? Are you understand this question or not? How to do this question? Ha, bagi tahu teacher, faham ke tak sebenarnya soalan ni? Nak apa? Faham Faham? Class, faham ataupun tidak? Are you understand or not? Sikit je faham Tak Tak faham, okay Tak faham, okay Okay everyone yang tak faham tu Okay Look at here. Okay, semua tengok sini. Hmm. So, problem solving ni, you can just practice lah. Kalau jawab soalan biasa je, direct question je, ya, dia takkan menjabar kamu untuk kamu selesaikan case-case yang macam ni. Okay, you guys bayangkan kalau ayah you guys beli satu kotak limau. Dalam 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 kotak limau tu mesti ada banyak kan betul tak? Kenapa tak ayah beli kot, satu kotak limau betul tak? Kenapa tak ayah dengan uh, mak kamu buy one box of orange? Pernah? During Chinese New Year kan? Especially ni. Pernah kan? Okay. So here one box ada 85. One box we have 85 orange. Okay. One box. So, if the seller buy 130 box of orange, so you kena dapatkanlah dulu berapa total actual number of orange, berapa jumlahnya kesemua orange tu. So, how to get the total number of orange class if one box consists of 85 orange? How to get the total orange of 130 box or, of orange Macam mana kelas? Jadi kita nak dapatkan jumlah orange Kalau satu kotak ada 85 Nak dapatkan 130 kotak Macam mana kelas? Siapa tahu? Kena guna operasi apa? Yes, good Amira darab Daripada satu ke banyak Okay, satu kotak Kita nak tahu 130 kotak One box We want to know 130 box You kena guna darab Ya yeah, daripada sikit ke banyak Kamu kena darab So here We get first the total number of orange 130 times 85 Everyone please help me 0 times 5 Everyone help me 0 times 5 Okay, so, zero. Ah, zero. Five times three. Class, five times three. Lima belas. Lima belas. Okay, we put five here and one here. And then five times one. Ah, that wish for him. One times yeah. five. One times five. Class, one times five. Five. Five, okay. Five plus one, six. Six. Then, after we done with five and then we multiply with eight. Eight times zero, class. Eight times zero. Eight times zero. Oh. One, zero. Eight. Times three, eight times three. Plus eight times three. What is your answer? Eight times three. Anyone? Eight times three. Mio. Eight times three. What is your answer, Mio? Siapa boleh tolong teacher? 8 times 3 Sorry? What is it? Class 8 times 3 Yes Amira, what is this? 20 
24. Okay, 24. So, here, 24 and then 8 times 1. Plus, 8 times 1. Afi Ryan, Ifan Hashim, Ahmad Adam, Raiz, Takim, Isam. 8 times 1. Okay, eight. Eight plus two. Apa? Eight plus two. Ah, enam belas. Eight plus two. Eight plus two. Eight plus two is equal to ten. Okay, you all darah okay ke tak ni semua ni? Are you? Understand how to multiply two numbers. Semua ingat sifir ke tak ni? Semua apa tak sifir? Afal. Afal. Nah, kenapa tak respon teacher tanya? Okay, and then after we multiply, we want to plus. Okay, these two number, zero here, zero plus, zero plus, five plus. Five. Five. Ten. Yeah. Satu atas. Satu. Yeah. Satu. So, we get eleven thousand fifty. Orange. Ah, uh, so here is the total number of orange. If the seller sells one and sorry ten thousand, so what is what is the left? So how to get the left? Ah, uh, lima yang tinggal. Macam kita nak cari balance. What operation we want to use? Plus, plus or minus? So yeah, okay. balance. Yes, tola. So we have 11,050 orange minus with 10,000. So can anyone give me the answer? What is the answer class? Hmm. 11,050 minus 10,000. What is your answer? Yes. 1,000 eh? And 50. 1050. Ini adalah balance limau yang ada. Okay, boleh? Naura, have you understand? Yes. Okay, so soalan macam ni you guys kena betul-betul tengok lah ha, maklumat dia apa. Sebelum ni jarang ke jawab soalan problem solving class? Hmm? Respond me please. Ha? Ha? Hmm, no. Apa dia? Before ni jarang ke jawab soalan problem solving? Eh, jangan sangat. Apa dia? Selalu ke ataupun macam mana? Ada masa. Ada masa. Okay. So you guys kena practice and practice. Eh? Okay teacher will give you another question. Please try this question pula. Sekejap eh. Cik bagi soalan baru. Okay, I give you soalan yang senang lah. Soalan ni, cik percaya semua boleh jawab. Boleh tak semua try? Soalan ni senang je. Ya. Yeah. Uh, ni uh, tengok how you determine the place, write the word in, write, uh, write in number. Okay. Write in number. Okay, please try everyone. This question. Uh, sebab teacher nak tengok semua try jawab soalan ni. Have you get it or not? Okay, uh, faster. Please try. Okay, the diagram show a number of, a number card, okay, 100, 108,459, okay, what is the place value of the underlying digit? 108,459. Okay, Mio is done. Okay, class. This one is simple question. Okay, please try. Write 
the uh, for one a write in place value b write in number write the word in number okay please try for those yang tak join tu kenapa ya boleh bagi tahu sebab tak can you give me the reason why you don't join me doing this exercise Kenapa? Kenapa? Bagi tahu teacher kenapa tak join? Ifan Hashim, lagi siapa yang tak join? Okay, kelas faster. Place value, nilai tempat kelas, not digit value. Okay, bezakan place value dengan digit value. Can I give you another three minutes? Amira? Have you done Amira? Not yet, okay. Dawish Koyim, have you done? Tak ada pun. Dawish tak siap lagi pun. Ni terkeluar ni Dawish. Lepas tu Dawish, kita dah jawab soalan baru ni. Masuk balik. Happy Ryan, I have you try, okay. Okay, where is Akil? Akil, I don't see your answer. Which is tak masuk. Okay, class. I give you again the link. Okay, this is bagi balik link ni. Siapa yang tak boleh join tu? Try again. Teacher tanya sekali lagi yang tak respon tu. Tanya yang elok ni, teacher tak ada nak marah-marah. Teacher nak tanya yang elok ni, kenapa kat yang lain tu tak join? Teacher. Do you have any problem ataupun juga memang tak nak join kelas? Bagi tahu teacher kenapa sebab? Give me reason. Kenapa tak nak join? Tak boleh masuk ke apa? Bagi tahu teacher. Jangan buat teacher tertunggu-tunggu kamu. Bagi tahu teacher, kenapa you guys tak join buat soalan tu? <laughs> ah, alasan tu yang kita nak tu, Akhil. Okay. Ah, Akhil, okay, dia tak nampak ni. Tak keluar, Akhil. Okay? Sekejap, mungkin internet teacher kot. Okay, good Haikal. Oh, here. Ribu. Have you done? Have you done? Okay, nak tak apa. Saya kita discuss. Okay. Another one minute class. Faster. Okay. Let's discuss. Ah, who want to 
share the answer. Siapa nak bagi tahu jawapan dia? Naura, can you? Okay. Okay, for one A, what is your answer? I can show on the number card. Okay. 10,000. Okay, Naura say 10,000. Is it correct, everyone? Betul ke 10,000? Betul ke no. salah? Is it correct or not, class? No, correct. So, Mio. Kita tengok Mio. Mio jawab apa? Mio answer this question. Where is Mio? Mio, Mio, Mio. Mio, okay. Mio answer 100,000. Is it correct class? 100,000? Yes. So here, okay. Kalau 10,000, zero. 10,000, zero. Eight is thousand. Okay, one is, ah, nilai tempat ni ialah 100,000. Okay. Boleh, Akil? Why we write in word? Kenapa kita tulis dalam no, dalam huruf, dalam ni, kataan? Because place value, nilai tempat. Place value ni nilai tempat, kamu kena tulis dalam perkataan. Kalau digit, baru kamu tulis dalam nombor. Teacher nampak tadi? Few of you yang tulis dalam nombor. ah Salah lah. Macam Akhil kan, Akhil? Salah yang kamu punya sebab kamu tulis dalam digit. Kita nak dalam perkataan. Place value, ingat bayangkan rumah kamu. Tempat nama, tempat tinggal kamu, nama apa. So, place value adalah in word. So, 100,000 is the answer. Okay, for 1B. Hilang. Akhil punya hilang. Okay. For 1B, teacher nak tengok Raiz punya. Raiz, can you read your answer? Raiz? Where is Raiz? Okay. Ah, Raiz, can you read your answer? Two, two hundred, three thousand, yes. four, four hundred and five. Okay, two, zero, three, four, zero, five. Is it correct, everyone? Two, zero, three, four, zero, five. Is it correct or not? Anyone? Yes. Hafiz Raya, betul ke salah? Hafiz Raya, is it correct or not? Huh? Yes or no? Yes or no, Hafiz Raya? Yes. Yes. Mama Akil, yes or no? Amira Sofia, yes or no? Asma, yes or no? Correct or not? Asma? Yes. Is it correct or not this answer? Wrong. Wrong. Asma say wrong. Why? Okay, this answer is correct. Two thousand, sorry, two hundred three thousand. Okay, dua ratus tiga ribu, betul? So, two thousand three, sorry, two hundred three thousand four hundred and five. So this answer is correct lah. Okay. Yang Asma buat ni tadi, Asma tu 2345. This one is wrong. Okay. So be careful everyone. Read the question properly. Jangan careless. Okay. Last question for today before we end our class. I want you to answer this question. Okay. Last question eh. Before we end our class. Can we class? Can we do the next question? Boleh ke tak ni semua? Masih larat ke? Boleh ke tidak ni? Yeah. Boleh. Okay. Let's, uh, uh, jom kita buat sama-sama. Uh, jom kita buat sama-sama. Okay, I want you to do this question. Okay. Alright, class. Who want to read this question first? Siapa nak bacakan soalan ni? Who want to do? Ha, siapa nak baca? Who want to read? Alamak, kita tak ada. Hello? 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 Kelas? Hello, kelas? Hello? Yes. Are you with me? 
हेलो क्लास यस हेलो ओके दिंगा दिंगा ओके अलमा टीचर punya whiteboard kita keluar so okeylah kita try jawab dekat whiteboard ni jelah whiteboard dekat zoom ni okey kelas jom tengok macam ni kita dia macam nak masukkan soalan kan dekat sini tak boleh eh kena guna yang ni juga jap Okay, class. Can you see the equation? Dah nampak tak soalan kelas? Boleh. Boleh. Ha, teacher tak share pun kita nak jawab sama-sama yang ni. Okay. Who want to read this question? Siapa nak baca soalan? I want to choose lah. Girls. I want Kaisa Alisha. Can you open your mic? Yes. Okay. Read this question for me. Rosalie has. Rosalie has. Rosalie has one and 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 this and he will miss all of this. And each page have four pages. Have how many pages does the handbook have? Okay, do just read it, Kamu. Thank you, Iza. Can you read again this question, Iza? Iza. Yes. Okay. Can you read read again this question for me louder? Rosilla has one hundred. Ninety Malaysian stem. One hundred or one thousand. Orange stem. Orange stem. He arranged all the stems in 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 an album. Each page has forty stem. How many pages does the album have? Okay, so okay, Rosli, Rosli, ada seribu enam ratus sembilan stem Malaysia dan juga stem dua negara sebanyak tujuh ratus. The okay, one thousand six hundred and nine Malaysia stem and seven hundred eleven foreign stem. So how we want to solve this question, class? Siapa tahu? Who want to answer this question? Siapa tahu nak selesaikan soalan ni? Teacher Lack. Hello, class. Do you hear me? Yes. Okay, class. How to solve? How to solve this question? Each page has 40 step. Yes, Akim, how to solve this question? First step, we want to get the total stem yang Rosli ada. How to get the total? What operation we want to use if we want to get the total stem that Rosli have? Macam mana kelas? Nak dapatkan total stem, kita kena guna operasi apa? Plus or minus? Total Tambah. Okay. So please help me. 1,609 plus 711. Okay. Who want to write in my whiteboard? In my screen. Siapa nak tulis jawapan kat screen teacher? Hmm. Ada siapa tulis? Tak ada. Okay. Kalau tak ada boleh bantu teacher. 9 plus 1. 
Happy Raya, 9 plus 1. 9 plus 1 is 10. Okay, 10. Iza. Iza, 1 plus 1. For you, yes, one, teacher. 1 plus 1. 1 plus 1, 2. Dawish for him, 6 plus 7. Uh, 6 plus 7. Sekejap je. Hmm. 6 plus 7. 14. Huh? 6 plus 7 again. 14 teacher. Mana 14 nya? Huh? 6 plus 7. 13. 13. Okay. 1 plus 1. Plus 1 plus 1. Okay. 1 plus 1, 2. 2. Okay. We have 2,320. Okay. Plus. How to get how many fish in the album if each fish has 40 steps. So, what operation we want to use class if we want to get how many fish? Then, kita nak tahu kita nak tahu berapa banyak fish sekiranya satu fish ada 40 step. Ah, Kita nak tahu. Kita nak separate kan how many fish. So, uh, the word uh, each fish tu has 40 step tu dah merujuk kepada sesuatu Operation. Yang mana operation ni ialah apa kelas? Uh, how many page? Kita nak kakit how many page? Operasi apa? Kita nak dapat kan? Ini kita nak split equally. Operasi apa kelas? Kalau satu ni ada empat puluh saja. Operasi apa? Ya, yes, cikgu dengar tadi. Divide, bahagi. Bahagi. That's very good. So here we have 2320 divide with 40. Okay. Uh, one Haikal, can you read me Multiplication of 4 Sipi 4 Kelas, boleh baca Sipi 4 tak kata teacher Nak jawab, okay, okay Baca, okay, Sipi 4 Pasta Sipi 4 Empat kelas dah nak ambil masa dah ni. Empat. Lapan. Enam belas. Dua puluh. Dua puluh empat. Dua puluh lapan. Tiga puluh. Dua puluh. Dua puluh. Dua puluh. Enam. Tinggal sini. Empat lapan dua belas. Okey. Empat lapan dua belas. Okey kelas. So twenty four. Yang paling hampir ialah. Twenty. Twenty yang ke berapa kelas? Yang ke? Lima kan? Tapi sekarang ni Kita buat empat puluh kan? Teacher lupa nak tambah kosong kan? Yes Tambah zero So here 232 yang paling hampir adalah 200 Yang kelima And then we get 32 balance 32 We put zero here and then 320 here And then yang ke berapa ni? Yang ke lah Yes so we have 55 page of album. So that's it. Okay class. Uh, nanti kita akan sambung lagi. Uh, doing problem solving. You guys okay tak ni hari ni? Okay tak hari ni? Next time kita guna yang lain pula eh. As, siapa tadi request? Naura kan? Nak guna apps lain. But nanti cik bagi apps lain pula. Okay so thank you class for today. Let's end our class with Tasbih Kifaro and Surah Tul As. Okay, bye bye class. Assalamualaikum. Bye bye.